Hi everyone. In this video, we are going to discuss this example. So the question is prove or disprove. They are given one statement. Every closed ball B X R in a metric space is compact. So actually, this statement is not true. So this thing we are going to prove. So for that, we have to give one counter example such that we have to find a closed ball which is not compact. Such example we want. Okay. So let us write. So I am going to consider a metric space. R D. Consider a metric space R D. So where D is a discrete metric, okay? Where D is the discrete metric. So I hope all of you are familiar with a discrete metric. It is defined as let me write here. So it has very simple definition. d of x y is equal to zero if x is equal to y and it is equal to one if x is not equal to y. So in a discrete metric, there are metric space. There are only two distances, zero and one. If points are same, the distance is zero, and if points are distinct, the distance is one. Right. So such metric space we have. So now I am going to consider a ball, open ball, uh, sorry, closed ball with center zero and radius two. So let me write here. Consider a closed ball. Since we want a closed ball, right? Closed ball with center zero and radius two. Okay. So let us find that closed ball with center zero and radius two. So the definition of closed ball says x belongs to R. Right, since our metric space is R, such that distance between x and the center of ball is less than or equal to two. So, by definition of closed ball, we can write this. This is equal to x belongs to R. Right, distance must be less than or equal to two. But as you know, in the discrete metric, there are only two distances, zero and one, and both distances are less than two. So, therefore, I can write here. So d of x zero can be zero, or distance between x zero can be one. Both possibilities are possible. Let me remove this definition now. See, both possibilities are present here since distance is less than or equal to two, and zero and one both satisfy this condition. Is equal to x belongs to R. When we say the distance between two points are zero, it's zero. It means Both points are equal. That means x is equal to zero. Or in discrete metric space, when we have the distance between two points are is one, if these two points are unequal or distinct, getting so two possibilities are there. So either x is zero or x is non-zero. Actually, uh, all uh, points of real numbers satisfy this condition. So this is nothing but entire metric space R. Since if you take any point of R, either it is zero or it is non-zero, so that's why all points of R satisfy this condition. So you can take say the closed ball with center zero radius two is nothing but a entire real line R. Getting so this is a closed ball we have with center zero and radius two, right? See clearly, clearly B. Closed ball with center zero radius two is equal to R is an infinite set. Obviously, it is an infinite set set since in R there are infinitely many elements, right? But in a discrete matrix space, in a discrete matrix space, there is one result: only finite sets are compact. Sets are compact. See this result we have already proved in our previous videos, right? So if you want the proof in details, you can check my playlist. You can find the proof of this result. Okay. So in a discrete metric space, only finite sets are compact. So that means if you have any infinite set, it is not compact, and this ball is an infinite set. So that's why it is not compact. So therefore, B zero two is Not compact. Getting it is not compact. So that means we got a closed ball which is not compact. 
so closed ball which is not compact that means given statement is not true right so yes solution is over make a screenshot of it then we will stop thank you see you